alla nasses. Different types of stars. A star is a ball of plasma that has enough mass to crush itself in the core and cause fusion and give out energy. There are different types of stars in the cosmos. Here are some of them. M-type stars are red dwarf stars. Over two thirds of all stars are M-type stars. They emit only 5% light as the sun does and they usually live over 100 billion years. They often have uh, less than half the diameter of the sun and less than half the mass also. K-type orange dwarf stars are usually around 10% shorter in diameter and have 20% less mass than the sun. Although K-type stars are only around 20% less massive than our sun, they emit less than half of the light. They're more numerous than the sun and can last up to three times longer. K-type stars are considered to be the most likely to harbour life on the nearby planets because they stay in main sequence for a very long time but still give off enough energy to keep water liquid on the surface of planets without tidally locking them. Our nearest star, the Sun, is a G-type yellow dwarf star. It is believed to last between 5 and 10 billion years and is surprisingly stable throughout that time. F-type dwarf stars are usually around twice the mass of the Sun and they are about a third wider and they appear as a blue-white colour. However, these stars emit six times the brightness roughly of the sun and have a much shorter lifespan. A-type blue stars are still considered to be dwarf stars but they are much bigger than the sun. Many of them are more than three times the mass of the sun and nearly three times the diameter and they emit more than 80 times more light than the sun does and they live a much, much shorter life and they're much rarer than the sun is. B-type blue stars are absolutely massive. If one was nearby the sun would look like a planet in comparison. Many of them emit around 15 to 20,000 times more light than the sun does. It's not unusual for a B-type star to have around 15 to 18 times the mass of the sun. And when they die, they, they're, after their very short life, they explode with this extreme violence. O-type stars are absolute monsters. They are usually 60 times the mass of the sun roughly and they're twice as big as B-type stars usually and they emit over a million times more sunlight than the sun does. Please check out my book, Unanswered Questions of Alan and John Booth on Kindle. It's a debating framework and it has many questions and many topics covered inside it. Alanasis.